Hey guys! So today I wanted to film a review slash tutorial on the infamous sleep stylers. So they look like this. I've seen these all over YouTube and Instagram. A lot of people have tried these. Um, these were actually on Shark Tank, which is where I saw them and they worked really well on there. So I have high hopes for my length of hair. All the tutorials that I've seen, the girl's hair are a lot longer than mine. So we'll see. Um, you're supposed to be able to sleep in them. They're supposed to feel like little pillows on your head so they're comfortable and there's no issues. So hopefully these work. Um, so it says to divide damp. So it says to take a relaxing shower at night, wash and condition your hair as you normally would. Divide damp hair into sections and wrap each section of hair around a plush roller. So with my experience, I have tried using damp hair with overnight curls and I feel like it never looks good. So I'm going to dry my hair about probably 90 to 95% of the way and then I'm going to use these. Just because past experiences, I know that damp hair does not work well with overnight curls. So I'm going to show you the products that I put into my hair and then we'll get started. So I recently got this from Sally Beauty. This is their Ion Leave-In Conditioner. It smells really nice, so. Maybe. Come on. There we go. So I'm just gonna put some of this in my hair, especially on my ends, because my ends are pretty dry. And I'm going to take this Smooth Blow Dry by Garnier. And I'm just going to put a little bit in my hand and then just put this all throughout my hair. All right, last but not least, this is my favorite stuff in the entire world. This is the Paul Mitchell Skinny Serum. It smells like green apples and it makes your hair so soft and shiny and just amazing. So my hair is pretty dry. There's definitely some wetness in it still. So let's go ahead and open up these bad boys and see what we got. So I have the large size. I know they have mini ones on there too, but I think this would probably work best for my hair. All right. Oh, oh, this feels like a pillow. Wow, it's really soft. It almost feels like a goose down pillow. Like that texture, that feeling. It, I wish I had like a pillow like this. This feels really nice. So it looks like this. Um, you have this little strap that goes around your curl. So I feel like if your hair was any shorter than mine, you'd probably wanna go with the mini rollers. But yeah. There are eight rollers in here. Whoa! There you go. There's eight rollers in here. Um, let's just get started. I'm actually gonna film a voiceover for that part. So, yeah. Let's see how it goes. Fingers crossed. All right, so here we go. It is finally time to use the sleep stylers. So I am going to start on the side that I part my hair and I'm going to take a pretty decent sized section of hair, um, almost the same width as the roller. Well, maybe not. No, definitely not the same width of the roller, but you can see how much I'm taking. And then I'm going to wrap my hair. I'm going to wrap it away from my face. This is very important. Make sure you're wrapping away from your face. And I did do it kind of tight. And then I'm going to take the strap, I'm going to take it under, and I'm going to wrap it towards my face. This is very important too. So once I do that, then I'm going to latch it onto the Velcro at the bottom, and it sticks. It does not move. I did not have any trouble with these all night, and I am a very crazy sleeper. I sleep all over the place, so you're good. Alright, so we're going to do the same exact thing. I'm going to take a curler. And then I'm going to take my hair and wrap it away from my face. And again, I do this pretty tight so I have a nice bouncy curl when I wake up. 
assuming I have a nice bouncy curl when I wake up. Um, and then you take your strap and you wrap it towards your face. This is very important and it does take some getting used to. Like I kept messing up, but you'll get the hang of it. And then just attach it to the Velcro. And then you just keep doing this. So I'm pretty sure I used all eight. Well, maybe not. I might have used seven. I don't remember. But yeah, just keep doing it. <laughs> Not sure how I feel about them right now. With them all in my hair, I'm like, is this gonna be comfortable to sleep in? I don't know, so yeah. But I'm going to bed. I'm gonna show you my laptop because I can't find my phone. But hopefully you can see that. It is nine o'clock. Nine o'clock on the dot. I'm gonna be up like probably 6.30 or so. So we'll see how these hold up. I am a very rough sleeper. I move around all throughout the night. So I don't know how these are going to hold up. But yeah, we'll see. And I'm excited. <laughs> hey guys. So I slept in these bad boys all night. I literally just woke up and got ready. Um, it is 6.30 in the morning I'm freaking tired but that's besides the point so these weren't too bad to sleep in they were pretty comfortable um, I was really tired though so I didn't really mind I mean I knew they were there it didn't feel exactly as soft as I thought it would feel when I was sleeping on them so but I will say it wasn't bad sleeping in them but I did check on a couple curls right before bed and I can tell you just having these in my hair for like two hours that I already had curls so you probably don't have to sleep in these overnight oh yeah let's get started and see what we have so I did not talk during this section because I'm actually gonna post this on Instagram as well and I didn't want my mouth moving so I'm doing a voiceover but here is what the curl looked like. It's super pretty. It's a lot prettier than what I was expecting. I was expecting it to be like crimped and just not a curl. But these turned out really nice. They're very soft looking curls. And it honestly looks like I used a curling iron. And then this one turned out just as good as the first one. So they're both very springy, very soft. They look incredible. These are not the curls I was expecting, so you can imagine how pleased I was. I, I didn't really have to touch up any of the pieces. I just took these curlers out, kind of brushed them out, and went straight to work. So it was awesome. And yeah, this one, the last one on this side turned out just as well. Okay, so this side did pretty well. Um, I like the side that I part on much better but this side was okay so we got a pretty nice curl out of this for sure um, and you'll see the next one it looks pretty darn good as well I definitely wasn't mad at it <laughs> so I don't know why but for some reason like this side it's probably because I have less hair on it because I part my, all my hair on the other side but when I brushed out this side, it just didn't turn out that great. I don't know why. But this is what they looked like. Of course, your hair is going to shrivel up because of all the curls. Um, so you just want to take your fingers and separate them. I just kind of ran my fingers through it. And then I kind of pulled the curls apart. And you definitely want to do this a few times to really loosen up the curls because... I don't think anyone wants to wear their curls like how they just were. So just keep on doing this. All right, so then you just want to do the same exact thing to the other side. Just run your hands through your hair. You don't want to brush out these curls. You just want to use your fingers. But you can see as I brush out the side, it kind of loses its curl a little bit. And it just kind of looks funky to me. Maybe you guys don't see that, but I think the other side looks much better. So next time when I do it, I'm just going to do it on dry hair because I think the results would look great on dry hair. Um, 
Like I said, this side was a little bit more damp, so I don't think it got the best curls, but this side looks awesome. I'm very happy. I'm really happy. I think they turned out great. Like, girl, I'm digging it. Definitely like big, loose curls. I mean, these aren't like spirals. These are like beach waves. So I think this did pretty darn well for my length of hair. Honestly, I didn't have high hopes for it, but I think it turned out pretty well. I mean, I'll probably touch up this side, but, or I'll wear my hair like this, actually. I'll probably just do this. Yeah, I I like these. I'm definitely gonna try them again. Um, like I said, you don't have to sleep in them. I checked on my curls and I had curls after like two hours. So you'll definitely get curls from these. These are great. They weren't horrible to sleep in. Um, they're very soft, but like when you lay your head on it, you can definitely tell that you have something there it doesn't like squish down all the way it kind of stays like this so but i like them and i think they are worth it so let me know what you guys think and if you're going to try them love you guys bye